our first year to have this. And these people are our sponsors. We have uh, Chris Williams from First Security, Lacey Brooks and Chad Hendricks from Everett, and then we have Doug Hendricks, David Hendricks, and David Hendricks Jr. representing Big Red, and they are our three sponsors for the train. So we so appreciate them coming out and being a part of what we're doing here. And one of the things that Judge Airy has always had in his heart is he's very community-minded. And so when he became the county judge, his goal was to make the community be welcome here, that he is always available. The courthouse is open to our community, and Christmas is the best time of all for everybody to come here and to enjoy all the beautiful things that we have. And so that is one of our goals with the train is that kids and adults alike can come and take pictures. We've tried to make venues around the courthouse where they can just have fun. We want the families up here, and then we have a lot of nights that we have Santa Claus and Mrs. Claus. All of our pictures that we take of the children are free of charge. The parents can download them and make as many copies as they want. We give away hot chocolate and cookies every night that Santa Claus is here. And of course, the night of the parade, which is Monday the 5th, this coming Monday at 6, we're gonna have Ned Permy over here on this corner. And we have a contest where the fifth grade students in the county write a little essay. We give them a question and they write an essay and the overall winner gets $100 from our Justice of the Peace, J.R. Walters. And all the other school winners get $50 a piece. But the overall winner gets to come and light up the courthouse. So it's a big deal for her and it's a big deal for us. And so Mr. Permy will be here taking care of that. So anyway, we invite y'all to come out. Connie and um, Angel and Audrey have some schedules that will give you the nights that Santa Claus will be here. And also we're part of the Arkansas Trail of Holiday Lights. And so we're hoping by that to bring in tourism and lots of people from all over the state to come and see. Cause I think we have the most beautiful courthouse in the whole state. And we have an awesome crew that does all of the work to make it look like this for Christmas. So anyway, um, if you'd like to ask questions of any of these wonderful sponsors here, Y'all are welcome. Where, where did the uh, train come from? Like built? How, where did we it come ordered from? it from a company called Holiday Lights and Magic. Um, it's made in, uh, I don't know if it's made in the USA, but the company's here in the USA. But anyway, we ordered it and uh, Connie went to each of these people and shared our vision and asked if they would like to be a part of it and they were very excited too. And also I, I need to mention as well, Big Red and Community Coffee are sponsoring two nights, December 15th and December 16th. They will be here with the big red, I mean the community coffee trailer. Yes. And they will be giving away the hot chocolate and the cookies. And the bus, yes. 107, will also be here those two nights. We're super excited about that as well. So kids can get inside the train? Yes. Kind of explain that. Well, um, there's they can get in here and take pictures. The little cart, we've got it fixed so that it can hold kids, it can hold adults. <laughs> We've had guys, maintenance guys standing on it to make sure it was safe for them. So they can get in there and take pictures. And uh, all the gift boxes around and the little photo boards, they're all just for people to come and take pictures. Was it uh, hard to, to get this here? <laughs> well. <laughs> like, the, the whole, like the whole process from the idea? Yes, to... when we received it at the road department, it was in about five boxes. So our, our uh, road department guys put it together for us. And then we had a big day yesterday morning where they brought it up on a trailer and they brought a big forklift and they set it on the lawn. And uh, we're actually going to add some lights to the wheels. We haven't had a chance to do that yet. But they're chaser lights and so it'll look like the wheels are turning. And so yeah, it was a pretty big production to get it all put together and up here. So. Would y'all like to say anything? We're glad, to be a part. We're, we're glad to be a part of it. It's our hometown and it's a beautiful courthouse and it's just another great reason to live in Slain County. How much did it cost? Uh, a little over $6,000. And each of these sponsors gave $2,000 a piece. And so this will, every year when we put out the train, we'll put that banner so that everyone will know that they were our sponsors for it. And if we ever decide to add more to the train, because you can add carts, <laughs> we may be back. <laughs> Leanne and Audrey have the schedule. Oh, I forgot about the character night. 
I forgot one more thing. Really? One yeah. more thing, I've December 15th. I don't think I've ever met you. I'm there. Finger. Nice, nice to meet you. you. December 15th, yeah, we have a bunch of characters that are scheduled to go on to the lawn. Like to and we also have a uh, handout that has all the different characters in the so, Thanks for coming. We yeah. appreciate it. Come here, Chloe. We've got to do another thing. Oh, pardon me. Excuse me. <laughs> hey, Lacey, it might be better if they get on the other side. The courthouse in the background and the sun. Of course, they all have the sun grins. <laughs> well, because the sun's coming this way, you're going to get a silhouette. <laughs> Come on, Dave. You try not to trip over these cords. Get my shadow out of there. Look at Lacey.